Emirates Team New Zealand and their record-setting AC72 have been the stars of the show thus far in the Louis Vuitton Cup Challenger Series, and the star power increased Sunday on the Bay as Tom Cruise was a special guest of the Kiwis on the team's yacht, Imagine, during a race where Emirates Team New Zealand continued their dominance in this round-robin phase, taking their record in head-to-head -head matches with the Italian team to a perfect 4-0. and Here's Emirates Team New Zealand skipper Dean Barker. Uh, after the, the race... Um we had Tom Cruise and his uh, son uh, jumped on board and we took them for a bit of a um, blad around San Francisco Bay. Uh, Tom jumped on the on the handlebars and probably did a better job than I did. And uh, then we had uh, his son and it was sort of a little bit of a competition to see you get the top speed. And on Sunday, Emirates Team New Zealand beat Luna Rosa by 3 minutes and 21 seconds. Here's Luna Rosa skipper Max Serena. We want to be ready to face uh, Artemis in the semi-final and uh, we're working toward that today. We had the, probably the best uh, racing day in the water for us, and uh, we're pleased for that, and we're looking forward. And Artemis Racing is looking to join Luna Rosa at the start of the Louis Vuitton Cup semifinals on August 6th. Here's Ian Percy, the skipper of Artemis Racing. We um, suffered a horrendous accident, um, and one thing that we're all very, very sure about is we don't want that to happen again. We need to take baby steps, and we need to progress at our own speed, and at the end of that process, we'll be good to get out there and race. And by going undefeated in the round robin stage, Emirates Team New Zealand has elected to move directly to the Louis Vuitton Cup finals, which means the semifinals starting August 6th will be a two boat competition between Luna Rosa and Artemis Racing. With NBC Bay Area's coverage of the America's Cup, I'm Lawrence Scott.